FBI Director Christopher Wray was in the hot seat during a House Judiciary Committee hearing. Some Republican committee members accused the Trump appointee of politicizing the agency's investigations and also allowing a wide range of misconduct. Alex Cameron was at the hearing and has more from our News on 6 Washington Bureau. Well, Republicans have been itching for a chance to confront Director Ray for some time now over what many of them say is the weaponization of the FBI, as evidenced by the different way it investigates different people. Are you protecting the Bidens? Absolutely not. Director Ray said the FBI is not guided by political considerations, but Florida's Matt Gates argued the case of Hunter Biden and the fact that Ray won't acknowledge it as a shakedown suggest otherwise. To the millions of people who will see this, they know it is. And your inability to acknowledge that is deeply revealing about you. Republicans also demanded Ray respond to last week's ruling by a federal judge in Louisiana who concluded the Biden administration had been forcing social media companies to take down politically disagreeable free speech, mostly conservative views. The FBI is not in the business of moderating content or causing any social media company to suppress or censor. That is not what the court has found. Democrats on the committee, for the most part, gave Ray a chance to discuss the agency in a positive light, the way agents work to take deadly drugs off the streets. Those men and women who choose to dedicate their careers, their lives really, to this kind of work and fulfilling the FBI mission are inspiring. One Republican at the hearing actually thanked Ray for his service. Colorado's Ken Buck noted that Ray is a registered Republican and said he hoped that Ray wouldn't change his party affiliation at the end of the hearing. In our Washington Bureau, I'm Oklahoma's own Alex Cameron.